Good morning. It's morning for me with my coffee and and whatnot. Um, I thought I'd do a little video on stick twirls. Uh, some people love them, some people hate them. I love them because I think they're really fun and it's a bit of excitement at a gig and it's all good. So I will show you the first one that I do is fairly easy really, it's just that it's an illusion. So what you do is you swear, in Britain that's swearing, sorry to be rude, put the stick in between and you just get it to move that way. So there's no uh, stick moving between fingers or anything like that, it's just an illusion. So I'll break it down for you. Do that and all you're going to do is you're going to move your fingers back and forth like that and the stick will start to move side to side and that's when you know Woo, I'm really close so let me show you that I'm moving my fingers back and forth like that now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start guiding the stick round with my first finger here so just keep your eye hit on this finger okay ah can you see it's bending it's kind of bending as it's moving side to side. So it's guiding the stick round. So I'll do it a bit slower for you. Okay, so just work on it. Keep doing that. It might hurt a little bit. You keep going with it. It will be worth it. If you're playing a groove, you just need to quickly put it between your fingers like that when you're playing. Not for long. And then just up. And swirl like that. Ooh. Ooh. It looks great, especially if you're going to like crash on a cymbal. It looks really fun. All right, stick twirl number two is it's just a half turn. So you're going to go from here to here. All right, literally just halfway. Boom. But the way I'm doing it looks a lot more complicated than it is. So. Let me break it down. Let me put that somewhere. Um, so, what do you do? What you're doing is you are releasing your fingers like that and you're moving the stick backwards. So, your palm is kind of facing outwards like that. So, you go from here, release the stick, kind of turn it around a little bit. So the tip of the stick is back like that. Now, when you're at this point, all you do is you take your second finger and you twirl it over like that. So let me show you again from this from this uh, end here. You're gonna start slowly moving it backwards. And when you get to there, you see my finger there? It's just twirling it over like that. The important part is when you're back here, and your finger comes underneath it like that and you're going to bring it back and down. It's that over, that movement that brings it over that I think makes it look so cool. Let me do it one more time. Okay, so let me show you how good that looks. It's, honestly, it's just a half turn. It's all in how you how you move it, and that I think can look really cool. 